What's going on, Hit Squad? This your main man, Hitman, and I am back. Once again, with the daily spawn updates for Red Dead Redemption 2 Online. This is for Family Heirlooms, All Laws, Jury, the Coins, of Air, 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 the coins, the arrowheads, the flowers, the antique alcohol bottles, all tarot cards, the bird eggs, and the fossils. Today is Sunday, July the 11th. And as I say each and every video, smash that thumbs up button if you find this video any bit informative or helpful in any type of way. And if you're watching, just browsing, just checking out the channel, just checking out the cycles, just checking out me in general. Make sure you guys subscribe. That's the most important part. Subscribe and hit that notification bell so you guys can get each and every video that I put out because I put out videos each and every day. If you guys want to know Madame Nazar's location any bit earlier than this video, make sure you follow me on Instagram and Twitter at HitmanMiyagiYT. How to spell that is in your bottom left hand corner. It's down below the video in the hashtag right underneath the video. In is in the description box below which is underneath the video as well uh first things first let's get to madame nazar's location which today madame nazar is right outside of valentine i guess we we'll call it and yeah, right down the road from valentine right along the D dakota river she's right here and she will be here until 2 a.m that's eastern standard time new york time zone east coast time zone for those of you who don't know or not of America. Uh, how I personally get to her spot when she's here is I simply fast travel to Valentine's. It'll put you at this post office or put me at this post office. I'll take the train tracks down till I get to this Rockstar feature series right here. Then you hit that little right on our screen right now. Currently it's a left. But if you're coming down towards Valentine, it'll be a right. So make this right down this way and continue towards you get towards the river that's right here the dakota river towards this end right here make sure you get down past this dotted line follow the dotted line until you get up in here somewhere you should see her off into the distance now, i think there's a bunch of trees over here just follow the path on down don't go that way make sure you come towards this way when the field opens up a little bit she's right here right down the way and as I said, she will be here until 2 a.m. That's Eastern Standard Time, New York Time Zone, East Coast Time Zone, for those of you who don't know or not of America. The Caribbean rum is right up the river. So if you do have your uh, wilderness camp, this is where I personally would just open up the wilderness camp, give me a spot around near her, and then fast travel back to Valentine and run up. <laughs> Because that's where I usually go to get to the antique alcohol bottle when it's right here at this location. Uh, I'll fast travel to Valentine, run up, get to this little fork in the road right here, go through it because there's a bunch of trees. This is like a forest, little forest right here. Right when I get to this fork in the road, I'll just run through till I get to this dotted line. When I get to this dotted line, I'll just follow it down and around till I get to the shack that's right here. See that shack? And the, the Caribbean rum antique alcohol bottle is right inside this shack. As I've said a couple times, this antique alcohol bottle helps you guys um, with one of the, the f uh, recipes for the moonshine shack. Sorry for the brain fart. It is. That's why it's kind of important. That's why I do tell you guys about it now because a couple people did ask me about it months and months ago. So I, I started, I put it into my rotation of things that I want to say on a daily basis. Um, let's get down here to where we normally do business, which see, that's a little broad, little range because we're all the way down to the bottom and kind of almost at the top of the situation right here. So we're going to minimize it just to uh saint denis road situation until we we actually go looking for things if you can mark the things that's now on your map so you can have something um have, have a little extra to go on your hunting to do the cycles anyway the cycles for today sunday 
July 11th are Family Heirloom Cycle 4, All Azuri Cycle 2, Coin Cycle 4, Arrowhead Cycle 3, Wildflower Cycle 3, Antique Alcohol Model Cycle 3, All Terror Card Cycle 4, Bird Egg Cycle 6, and Fossil Cycle 6. Remember to check the description box below because everything will be down there. The cycles, a link to a video for the current cycle of fossils so I can help you guys find those and how to spell the Twitter and Instagram for the channel. Remember the description box is directly below the video. It's like a little, I guess a sideways triangle or whatever, where you can, it's like a drop box where you click on it and the box drops and stuff like that. So if you don't know, that's where information is for the video if you know like a youtuber or whatever have something for you guys anywho let's get to these things that we will find across the map across the lemoyne area of the map starting with the one that's up here right here at this location at this house you guys will get two things actually right here there's a antique alcohol bottle and a tarot card the antique alcohol bottle is an old tom gin bottle is in the sink cupboard and the tarot card is inside on the table that's inside the house this tarot card is a six of pentacles by the way let's go down to our next marker which is a fossil this fossil is randomized i cannot tell you what it is we'll come right here at this location with your metal detector and that's what you will get Let's go down to our next marker, which is right here. This is a coin. This coin is randomized. I cannot tell you what it is, but there's a couple trees over here. There's one tree in particular that's dead and sticking out the ground. Go around the base of that tree with your metal detector, and that's what you will get a random coin. I want to tell you about something that I did not mark before we get to these next two markers down here. Right here, next to the word locay, there's an L-shaped shack. Right here at the back of the L-shaped shack, right there at that location, you will see a bench. On that bench, you guys will get a goat hairbrush, which is a family heirloom, if you guys want to collect that. Right here underneath the N and NWA, there's two markers. Let's start with the one on the right first, right inside this shack. You guys will get a Irish whiskey bottle. This Irish whiskey bottle is an antique alcohol bottle and it's inside the house on the table. You will see like a bunch of like counters and stuff like that, but there's only one table table. So it's pretty easy to find. This next marker is a bird egg. This bird egg is a egret egg, E-G-R-E-T. It's in a tree, shoot it down with a varmint rifle or a bow using a small game arrow. A varmint rifle or a bow using a small game arrow. Do not shoot it down with a regular gun. <laughs> okay, well, going over to our next marker, you guys will get a lost jury. This lost jury is inside this house in the chimney. This house is a lot bigger than uh, they allow you to get room. So the, is the chimney is like really like right there. I guess there's like two rooms that they don't allow you to go into, but right here at this location, this is the middle of the house where the chimney is. You position yourself in front of the chimney. It should give you a prompt to search the chimney. I think you hold square, you search the chimney and you will get a Durant Pearl bracelet right outside the house. There's a tree, a, a big tree right about here. Go towards this tree with your metal detector and you guys will get another random lost jury. This one is random because I can't tell you what it is. You have to dig for it. So they made it random. But come around this tree with your metal detector and shovel. And that's what you will get right above the, the Owen Bayou. Kind of. Right there. Right outside the house. Anywho, let's get to our next item. Well, matter of fact, we, well before we get to our next unknown item this marker right here is a fossil a random fossil i cannot tell you what it is what it is once again but make sure you pay attention to these lines in the map and go directly to this spot with your metal detector and that's what you will dig up a random fossil over here 
to this little shack or house right here. Inside this shack, on the table to your right, there's a king of swords. It's on the table with all the candles and stuff. So make sure you look for it over there. Use your eagle eye, see if it glows a little bit. But that's where it is. Uh, let's go back to the uh, right and get to uh, one of these markers over here. <laughs> right here is a tarot card as well, right here at this location. Right here, you guys will get a Four of Cups tarot card. This tarot card, this Four of Cups tarot card is on a box near a fountain with a light. The fountain with a light is right here. So just so you guys know, exactly the area that you're in if you don't go to this exact area when you do go to this area you should see like okay there's a fountain right there with a light in the middle of it <laughs> and that's kind of you know the situation i feel like this is what it was yesterday because there's a, there's a tarot card here this tarot card is a two of swords is near the fire right there and there's also a tarot card here if it wasn't yesterday it was like the day before yesterday but right here, there's a tarot card as well, which is a King of Cups. Let's go back to the left a little bit where our next marker is. And this marker is a family heirloom. This family heirloom is a ivory hairpin. It's on the table right on the other side of this little gate right here. Like There's a gate there. Go through that gate and you should see like a, another metal table. And right on that metal table, you will find your ebony hairpin right there at that location. Right here under the word saint, there's a house. This house has a backyard area where there's like patio furniture, chairs, tables, stuff like that. And right on the table of this patio furniture, you guys will find a cherry wood comb, which is a family heirloom. So go and grab that. Let's go down to our next marker, which is the cardinal flower that spawns over here each and every day. Over here in this area, each and every day, that helps me personally indicate exactly what cycle the flowers are on, which today, the flowers are on cycle three. Um, let's go down a little bit over here to our maybe last marker. I think this is our last marker for real, because I didn't mark anything in rows today. Right here at this location, you guys will get a random arrowhead you do not need your shovel for this one because this is a dig spot it's right at the edge of the cotton field that's right here it's a big big cotton field and right at the edge of it you should see like a spot um uh, like a like a pile of dirt and then where you could just dig so go over to it you will get a prop to dig if you got your shovel and you will dig up a random arrowhead i cannot tell you guys what arrowhead you will get because it is randomized so Go and grab that. I want to tell you guys about a couple of extras that I did not mark. Which one is a coin right here. A, ra a random coin. Come over here in front of this outhouse. You see this dot on the map. If you don't see the dot, it's very, you know, like faint or whatever, kind of. It's, it's a small dot. Go right there. That's an outhouse. Go right directly in front of the outhouse with your metal detector, and that's what you will dig up, a random coin. If you guys go to the Braithwaite Manor home, on the second floor, on top of the fireplace, first room to the left, you guys will get a Jade Hairpin Family Heirloom if you guys want to go and grab that. There's a couple tarot cards inside of Rhodes, which one is right here next to kind of next to the sheriff's office but the bounty board is on the sheriff's office so right here there's a table right on that table you guys will get a six of cups tarot card and right inside this little bedroom here there's a big house you can't go into the house but you can go into this little room i guess it's a little side room with a work table and stuff like that on that work table you guys will get a tarot card, another tarot card, which is a nine of pentacles. A couple more things before I end or end the extras for you. There's a creek plum flower here right next to the word pond. Make sure you pay attention to the lines and know exactly which area you are you're, you need to go to. Right there at that location. And inside this house, 
there's a family heirloom, which is a New Guinea rosewood hairbrush. This New Guinea rosewood hairbrush is in a chest in the bedroom. So go and grab that as well. All right, that's pretty much it for everything. I'm trying to put everything kind of in some kind of focus so you guys can see everything, where, where it is, the length of the little area that I have you guys going. <laughs> but the cycles for today, Sunday, July 11th, once again are Family Heirloom Cycle 4, All Azure Cycle 2, Coin Cycle 4, Arrowhead Cycle 3, Wildflower Cycle 3, Antique Alcohol Bottle Cycle 3, All Terra Card Cycle 4, Bird Egg Cycle 6, and Fossil Cycle 6. Once again, Family Heirloom Cycle 4, All Lost Jury Cycle 2, Coin Cycle 4, Arrowhead Cycle 3, Wildflower Cycle 3, Antique Alcohol Bottle Cycle 3, All Terra Card Cycle 4, Bird Egg Cycle 6, and Fossil Cycle 6. Just in case you guys cannot in hear me, understand me. Or anything like that make sure you guys check the description box below because everything will be down there the cycles a link to a video for the current cycle of fossils so i can help you guys look for those if you want to go searching for those and how to spell the twitter and instagram for the channel uh, thank you guys for watching looking listening it's your man man or <laughs> i don't know what i'm doing thank you guys for watching looking and listening uh, liking, sharing, commenting, subscribing, and all that good stuff I do appreciate. And I try to say it each and every video. And if you haven't, if you don't, make sure to like, share, subscribe. Hit the notification bell so you guys can get each and every video that I put out. Because I put out videos each and every day. It's your main man, Hitman, once again with another video. And I'm out.